guys, what's up? So today in bus update, we're gonna talk about a few things and uh, let's just go ahead and get started. That's weird. Hey! What you doing here? Hello. This is, this is odd. I uh, haven't done it in a while, but I bought a bus. Really? Yeah. Did you know, I'm sure, I'm sure this is something that we have in common. Thomas is my favorite brand of bus. Yeah. I love Thomas's. Same. They are love so it. good. So reliable. They are very reliable. They never rust. Never out. rust. They never Never do. rust. They are completely rust proof. Rust proof. And, uh. Best buses on the road. Let me show you what I mean. Here, look at the score. It's covered in dirt. It's rock solid. Yeah. All the way back. If you look at this rear door, look at this. No buzzer, no nothing. No buzzer. Just look at it. Oh, got a little step this, down. That's, yeah, that's nifty. So yeah, this, uh, this beautiful door, you know, these never ever rust no, out on Thomas's. No, never. I mean, yeah. wow, that exhaust is powerful. <laughs> it certainly is. Early 90s internationals, man. Yeah, it's got yeah. a little, uh, little set. I mean, look at that. Yeah. I mean, if, to be fair, if there was rust, you wouldn't be There's able to tell. There's 45 in this number. There is 45 in that number. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah. So, really, though, the story is I bought this from an auction out yeah. near Columbus, Ohio. Right. For the grand total of one thousand dollars, twelve hundred with taxes and fees. Right. But you know, it, it's a freaking. It, it's a nice. I mean, look at this. This for a Thomas. This is clean. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, so I like see. You don't have any mud flaps. Oh, that's right. a shame. There's no Thomas branded mud flaps. All the, must, uh, all the mud got on the inside. Right. Any mud flaps. Right. Just straight up for the wheel belt. Right. That's a typical Thomas, but this one, not so much. I'll get the other side. That's good. It has fluids inside of it for now. There's a microphone. There it is. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, we'll call it that. Does that work? Uh, I don't know because there is no radio. Oh. There's, uh, yeah. I don't know if it came with no radio or if they took it out. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just think that's an odd place because I feel like most older buses just had it up there. Yeah. Because right in here, it's right above the engine. And I just like to, yeah, it. that's what I'm saying. I just like to know what that sounds like while the bus is running. I mean, always retrofit a radio and try and find out. Yeah. Well, is it worth it? No. Yeah. So, yeah. I also, I don't know if you told your viewers anything about the race bus. I, I did not, no. No, but the, uh, the race bus is history. You want to go in the bus so we're not, yeah, like, yelling? Yeah, you know, that might be better. Right? I do like to yell, though. Yeah. Who doesn't? Who doesn't? Take these old mirrors. Gotta love the old mirrors. Look at that. So the double nickels. Yes. We got a Thomas-branded bottom step well, so that's nice. It's beautiful, unrusted step well. Yeah, I was, I was shocked. So let's let's talk about so race yeah, bus. Race bus is history. It is done. I done. saw it last week because the um, the owner of Lawrenceburg Speedway is selling. He's not selling the track, but he's selling everything that he had at the track. Yeah, it's changing owners. After I season. did in my video. I don't know if you saw it. I did kind of explain that in okay. the description, so they kind of know. But I, I don't know if everybody will watch that or not. So gotcha. probably not. Yeah, probably not. I know I wouldn't. You discount yourself. Yep. Anyhow, yeah, so I, I sold that to a guy who's going to use the powertrain for a dump truck, uh, and it's 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 gone. 
So the, the thousand dollars I made off that from selling the bus went straight into buying this bus. Yeah. That's a circle of life. Right. It's and a it cycle. Mo it moves us all. Yeah. The race bus just keeps on giving. Yeah. Just about. Except, would you say this is? As I look at the duct tape together seats, but you say this is a, this is an improvement over the race Personally, bus. yes, because it's got an international chassis. Yeah. But I mean, realistically, it's it's, it's an early '90s mechanical. Yeah, you can't you can't go wrong. Not rusted out. No, I mean, it has less rust than uh, like on the wheel well area area on the external yeah. than 45. Yeah. Exactly. So it's I mean it's well that's inform your viewers too this was oh not, yes this was not from around here this was an alabama bus if it had been from around here it'd be a different story this was from dothan city schools so you can see the original insurance original card, insurance card. Do you know what else is original about this bus? what the dash look at this dash you can tell i don't know if you can see it on his his little kinda. camera or not kind of 125,000 original miles that's uh if, it was a, if, if they had replaced the dash, you would have said, oh, no, those aren't the original no miles. Way. No, no the way. No way. Those are the original models. Yeah, wow. Unless it mysteriously stopped working for like five years. It could have. But um, anyway, Anyhow. give you a better look at the seats. Yeah, don't, don't look too hard at the seats. Yeah. We'll have to do like a before and after if, should, when yeah, you get this cleaned up. I, I yeah. just bought this uh, yesterday afternoon, so Did I they? had time to... Did they uh, cut anything. out? Yeah, those are interesting. The seat I guess numbers? For, uh, I, I guess. Or for names or something. It looks... Because this... Oh. Oh, okay. And for a second, it looked like they cut this, but... Oh, yeah. Uh, wow. But, yeah, at least to... Uh, I like this old font. Yes. I love that. On Thomas's, love that. love that. And these... It's great. Uh, I'm sure you've undergone this as well, but these uh, yeah these two rear windows. I'm I'm are... lucky that none of 45s are broken, but three has windows with broken latches. Yeah, so I'll need. To... And I do have latches. I mean, do you do you need to replace the whole window or just the you can just take, the latches? You can. I mean, it's a lot of work, but you should be able to take this top part. Of, you take the window out, take the top apart, and you should be able to replace that. That'd be ideal. And for all I know, Mike could have Thomas windows. Oh. I'm because it's like with, with I told him look for Wayne parts because he goes around to districts and he'll when they've yeah. got old stuff he'll take it so he could have Thomas stuff so like he's giving me carpenter rub rail caps because he found them and was like I don't want these to go to waste so yeah right. yeah we'll have to go over there or call him or something want to go for a ride? yeah um, and then at some point we'll have to get we'll have to go over there and get the two buses next to each other yes we certainly shall I don't know what these hooks are for, these weird hooks. I don't know. Where they're being used by hookers. Hmm. Maybe. You never know. You never know. You never I know. Have, I also have this up here, which I don't know. I've never seen one like this. It must be just older than I'm used to. Presumably there's, I, I would guess there's a camera. I've, I've not uh, seen one like this. It seems a little... I mean, maybe it was put into the... They cut through the Thomas logo, though. That sucks. Yeah, that, yeah. But, um... I've seen them where they stick out more, and it's uh -huh. like this basic yeah, it's a whole, like, enclosure. Yeah. But I've never seen one in this style. No, me Plus, neither. Plus, this is... This is weird, because, like, that, that wrapping stuff is yeah. on the inside. Yeah. I don't know how, uh... I don't know how they have this sealed up. But you're not able to open it with the latch like you usually. Uh, I don't know. It's weird. Uh, I'll right. just take a screwdriver to it or something. Yeah. Anyhow. Anyway. I digress. <laughs> Have you sat in any of these seats? No. I, I'm not going to do it in their current state. <laughs> I was going to say, realistically, do you want to sit in these seats? No. There are a couple of these that you might, like, actually fall through. Yeah. If you sat on them. Right. But, you know, if they're good enough for construction workers... They're good enough for us. Right? Are they? No. I don't know. I don't know. This is the one time a construction worker is watching my video and I'm going to get called <laughs> out. <laughs> Unsubscribed. <laughs> I just lose half. Half of them. He's going to leave a nasty comment on your video. Get a nasty comment. 
these mirrors, the way they're adjusted, it, it looks, I've never seen them like where they're on top of each other. Usually one's like, they're side by side. Right. Oh, uh, shit, I got fell. Yeah, don't do that. I'm not used to these low back seats. Yeah, yeah. These destroyed low back seats. You could replace them with high backs. I, you could. If you supply them, I'll, uh, I'll replace them. I don't them. know where I'd get all the high back seats, but. Well, if you mine so much, if you mine the low back seats so much, <laughs> you'll find a way. <laughs> where there's a will, there's a way. Exactly. So are these, are they using these little stones or markers? I'm not markers sure. I would assume so, but I'm not actually sure. It's kind of what they look like. I yeah. So, yeah, this is what it's like riding around in this Thomas. Yeah. You wouldn't know anything about riding around on Thomases, would you know? Not at all. You know what? <laughs> I'm, I'm going to say it. This Iowway is, I, I mean, it almost... I know there's differences, but it, it looks a lot like the one that's on the 2019 C2 that I ride. Oh, yeah. If it's not broke, don't fix it. Yeah. You hear that, IC? If it's not broke, don't fix it. We're talking about the design, not the bus itself. No, IC is in the habit of breaking things. They won't listen. Yeah. Okay. This one do they care? I walked into that one. Um, anyway. Well, if it's, an, if, if it's an IC, then, yeah, you definitely had to walk you wouldn't be riding in on that one. I knew I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> this one right here always likes to pick on IC, just oh, like I everybody do. else. Oh, I do. Um, anyways. This is, this is, uh, here, um, drop me off so I can get some, uh, like, oh, crap. Brakes work. Man, if only I had a stop sign to put out. Yeah, but well, if traffic hits me, I, I guess it's my fault. I'm in my safety spot. Are you taking a picture or taking a video? Video. What? Video. Go. Oh. Close the door and go. It's supposed to be this slow. What? It's supposed to be this slow. Does it close slow? No. I wouldn't. It sticks right there. I can't tell if it's just a really heavy hinge. <laughs> it should be easier to just slam. It might. It might be the way it's the way it latches. Like the. Well, I, don't like those I don't like those either. Yeah. It should be. Yeah. It should be that hard. yeah. Okay. Oh man, that's pungent. Look over there. Man, that looks good. There's my car and buses. Oh, here comes Peter. Let's see, he should be coming around. Oh, he's turning around.
Back it up. Back it up. You gotta wait for the bus. I know. To stop. I would like to get on the bus, please. Oh, please get on the bus. I will get on the bus. Oh, yes. Please. Thank you, bus driver. You are welcome. One of your batteries fell out. What? Oh, yeah, I forgot the strong. Oopsie, oopsie. Yeah, I don't know if the original came off or they replaced it or I haven't moved or what. out of this spot in a while. Well, uh, do it slowly. I I'll will. say that. I can't see shit. You're fine. I'm fine? You're good. You sure? You're good. If you're not, you'll find out. Thanks. Here we go. Yeah. Thanks for that. No problem. Sorry the windshield is so dirty. It's okay. I didn't get to clean it. <laughs> I didn't get to clean it or take the auction sticker off. Just send it right back. It was fun uh, not being able to see half of that mirror while I was on the highway. I, I like the thicker mounted signals. And yes. I would love to get a hood and retrofit the 45. I mean, I'd sell you this one, but it's white. Yeah, it's, it's an older hood. It doesn't have the uh, engine bashing on it. Oh, that's true. I already got one without the engine battery. Wow. What do you think? It, it, it drives. It does drive. Do you know what transmission this has? 545. That's what I think. Same, yeah. Based same old. Sound of it, that's what I think. Yeah, same old, same old. It's like such a. It, it, I, I really can't tell if they made it that way or if it just needs to be greased up or something. It probably needs to be greased. I like how the doors don't open. Like they're. Yeah. Because that would suck having to do that every single day. Yeah, they build up your uh, arm muscles for sure. Yeah. Now you sit down back there. Hey! Shut up! Shut up, kid! Shut up! Oh, that's not a kid, that's just the corner peeling off the seat. Oh, okay. Sorry, I got them mixed up. Oh, there's a bus. <laughs> a butt, yeah, there is. I forgot about that. Some inconsiderate person who also has a bus parked his right in the middle of the way. Let's go push it out of the way. Yeah, we can. Oh, somebody's throwing rocks at you. Uh, no, that's my tire throwing rocks at uh, campers, I guess. I don't know. It was doing that on the highway, too, which was fun. Oh yeah. Oh, cool. <laughs> Thank you, Peter. Very I know of at least one expletive we'll need to edit out. <laughs> well, let's try um, and keep it at one. I mark my videos uh, where they can stay in there technically, but <laughs> what's not weird? I go to act like we're parked. I haven't parked behind a bus like this in a while. Stop. Well, now you get to use the brakes. I feel like they, they work okay, but they probably do need some work. Yeah. I just, I hate that handle. And it's, yeah, it should stay like that, shouldn't it? Like this? Yeah. But it, it does, like, it should lock there, it right? Should lock. Yeah, I can but feel, it doesn't. I can feel where it. Like well, it, wait a second. Well, because it's just, oh, well, this might be why. It's just hitting this bolt. Oh. Right here. If I, if you screwed it back in there. 
it yeah. might lock. Right. Or it, I, I don't know. I don't know. It's a Thomas. I don't know a thing about Thomases. I really don't. I don't either. Well, the other thing. Tell this jackass to move. I know. Hey, jackass, move. The other interesting thing you might have noticed on this bus is that there are two temperature gauges. I, I did not notice that. Well, because there's that one on on the left there on the dashboard, and then there's that shiny silver one on the bottom. I don't know if... I'm suspecting that silver one is a replacement and that the other one doesn't work. But alternatively, alternatively I'm thinking it might have separate, separate gauges for the engine and transmission. Yeah. I don't know which is which. Oh, I don't know. Well, it's... I, I mean, I was... I was uh, trying to keep an eye on that because I was told that overheating is the, the common thing that kills... DT 360s. Yeah. Like I was told, if it goes above, like anywhere above like 200, you want to be careful. Yeah. But it hasn't so far. Well, that, that's good. Yeah, that's good, that's and it's good. still running. And it's still running. So, anyway, this is Noah. And th this is me. I drove and a Thomas International. You did. Kind of, kind of against. Time. I mean, when you look at it, the international part is all good. Everything. Like, the firewall and everything in front of the firewall is great. You know what? Here's what you do. You find a body that's the same size of, of, as this, as like, from a different manufacturer. Yeah. You strip off this junk, and you just make your own bus. Yeah. Just just find a perfectly good body. Wayne body just Wayne hanging bus. around somewhere. As if, as if there's one just hanging around. Yeah. As if there's one just, just hanging, hanging around. around. That was good. That was a good little camera maneuver. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah, just take all this off and you got a uh, perfectly good bus. Perfectly good bus. Anyway, I'm going to turn the camera off okay. now. My old bus. Yeah. Ironically, they were both, well, it's two completely different buses. But they're both international. Indeed. Yeah. Can't buy better than that. Nope. I'll show you guys what they look like together, because why not? I think my rear end looks better. Early 90s international diesel technology. Look at those LEDs. That's nice. Don't look at the ones up, up top. Those don't yeah, that's awful. Would you look at that? Would you look at that? And he was like, would you look at that? Would you look at that? He was probably like, would you look at that? Unbelievable. Would you look at that? What you looking at? Oh. I'm high already. <laughs> Yummy. Oh, I see it. Yep. Well, I don't know. It's hard to tell. It is. I don't know if that. I don't know. I don't know if that's. I don't know either. They could be. Yeah. So there they are. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. Okay. No, I do it's not. Very safe. Does not sound safe to me. They do this in Germany all the time. Not, they have survived. They have survived Thomas Internationals in Germany. Oh, that's definitely not true. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what it was. It's more of a Swedish or Scandinavian to me. I don't know. I am no expert. I don't know. All right. Bye! What? Oh, I heard that.